What's up, people? How you feel? I'm going to show you some books I read that I keep reheating the past and bringing it up to the future. Books that I, you know, books that I read, look, comprehend, understand, so I can, sometimes you have to go back you can read them from the front to the back. Sometimes you got to reheat it so it can stay prevalent in your mind. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and do some show and tell. It's an herb book. You see that? Okay. Um, what did it say? Nearly 2 million copies in print. It's way more than that now, because this book is fairly. It's this. This is. This is a. This is a. This book been around for a while. Let's put it like that. It's been around for a while. It's not new. You know, got a lot of illustrations of plants and stuff like that. This is a good book. You know. So this paperback right here. If y'all see it, order. It. Y'all got any more information, cross promotion to the offers and stuff. I'm supporting y'all. Y'all got y'all got any uh questions, y'all can feel free to comment section to ask me. And then I'll give you the, you know, the offers names and all that. I'll let y'all know. Of course this one. Of course, the 48 laws of power. Of course. People say you can use this to be a con artist, a scammer and all this. I don't know. You tell me, but I tell you what. Good information. Good information from other people's perspective on the way how to run things. You know what I'm saying? So this is good. Um... Very excellent. This is another good one. Very excellent book. The Encyclopedia of African American Heritage. Very insightful. Very, very excellent. Very good book. You know. Finally, sometimes you got to go back to the basics. And research and figure it out for yourselves. Just showing y'all what I be doing when I have time to do it in my spare time. Let me tell you something though. Let me tell y'all something. Hold on for a minute. I'm sure it's like some incense. Matter of fact, I ain't my incense stuff going on. Keep it real with my blunt life. Oh, oh these don't smell good too, boy. Yeah. Like me some incense. Get the chemistry. Get the chemistry rolling. Let's get into it. Now, I see what's going on on the and you know, you know, the ongoing bull crap of the internet. You know, people still want to play these games. You got to pray for these young brothers in the rap game and these young sisters. Cause they getting played. They definitely getting played. And it's a shame. It's a shame.
when you look at it. All for what? All for what, fam? For what? Brothers, it's up here. Sisters, it's up here. We possess so much power. You know what I'm saying? So why should we always feel as though that we don't possess? You know, we feel as though we don't possess this power. Because some of us are scared to, to, to harness it. You know, we, we got to harness this power. Economically, we can get this money. But you got to be like a wolf. This is this 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 is what this place is built on. This. Okay? It was built on this. But you see a bunch of a bunch of young folks, they get a record deal, they get this money, but they want to go back to the stuff that they was doing when they was in the hood. You see, they feel as though they owe the hood. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Very viable, young folks. I'm going to tell you something. Give, if you make a certain amount of money, an X amount of money, this is, this is, this is what I propose to you. This is what I propose to you all as young folks. Take that money to the people that you roll with. You know, the people that from the cradle, you know, the people that you grow with. Give them an ultimatum. Say, look, I'm going to give you this X amount of money. This can, this can go for male or female, vice versa. I'm going to give you one stop shop, meaning that I'm going to give you this money. Once I give you this money, that's it. Meaning that. You give them the money, but they can't take that money and flip it. That's on them. All that keeping the real stuff is keeping it retarded. No disrespect, but I'm telling you, people, you gotta, you gotta see the young folks. You gotta see this for what it's worth. If you making those bags, if you making those racks, if you making up team mounts. Your boys ain't going to see it that way. You know what I'm saying? They looking around. You top dog. It's always going to be an opportunist. It's always gonna, it, it only takes one. Hey, man. Then other people start following that guy. Then they end up, your own boys end up robbing you or doing things to you because they feel as though they're getting cheated. This is why when you the man, you got to cut ties with certain people. Even certain people you grew up with. Even certain people that's within your family tree. That's how it is, player. Or you gonna get played on. You gonna get played on. And that's what's going on. It's not, you know, I've been around the merger round, okay? I know what's going on. I don't know about the rest of these jokers on YouTube. YouTube is robbing us blind. Not to disrespect the platform I'm doing this video on, but I know the I know the 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 the, the essence of the game. You know, they're gonna get the lion's share. We we gonna they 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 gonna they see they manipulate what they want to get at us. Whether you monetize your videos or not, guess what? They still get paid. As soon as you upload it, dollar signs. They can, they can switch the policies, change the terms and conditions, blah, 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 blah. But they still get that bag. Well, what I see is a bunch of people on here desperate. Well, if you're going to grind, do it the right way. See, people feel as though they need to get into controversy. People feel as though they need to get into loss and they fraudulent it. You know, allegedly and and and, and, and um, false flagging and making up stories on people. See, you don't got to do that. 
You don't got to do that. Stick to your commentary. That's what I keep telling you. See, that's that those those demons, those those entities whispering in your ears. This is why you got all this clout chasing going on and all this trolling going on. Because people, I'm telling you, I'm gonna tell you one important thing. Y'all know how I roll. I can get on camera, get off of camera, it doesn't matter. If you love doing this, do it. I don't want to get on here to be famous. I don't want to get on here to be the next biggest YouTuber. I just express what I got on my mind. That's basically it. And what I want to bring to the table on this platform. You got people making up make-believe stories. People talking about people's wives. Children implicating folks. Folks getting hurt. All because... They put themselves in these corners financially. And they think this platform is going to be their lifesaver. I mean, I mean, I don't know how unless, and then again, the only ones that is like that is the ones that got big platforms, the ones that can, um, they got the watch hours, of course. They got the number of subscribers, of course. They had Super Chat, of course. They had Patreon. So, yeah, they're going to grind. But they get big-headed, see? They get big-headed. Then they result into trolling and talking about other folk. And then they get arrogant and think their channel is the only channel and everyone should bow down and worship them as a celebrity. Uh-uh. It don't, it don't go like that. It don't go like that, baby. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I get on here and tell y'all certain things for a reason. And I'm telling you, brothers, especially you brothers, all this, I told y'all before, I'm going to tell you again. Real G's do not get on the internet. Real men of the street do not get on this platform and talk about any and everything. Because I'm going to tell you what's going to happen. You're going to slip up and you're going to implicate dudes that's really in the streets and don't care too less. You know, nothing's about this. They trying to make those money bags. And you and by you getting on here, you are opening up stuff that don't need to be open. It need to be closed and stay closed because that's what it's supposed to be underground. I done told you all this. Y'all get on here. Some of y'all not even cut from that cloth. And y'all think. People ain't going to seek you out. And then when they seek you out, you're looking like a fool or worse. They're going to they're gonna hurt you, man. Or do or do or just go and do the whole nine. And you know what the whole nine is. Look, man, listen to the OG. It's not worth it. Lay y'all live. Enjoy yourselves like I'm doing. That's right. Enjoy yourselves. Spit your game. Spit your ism. Stay on cold. Get your grind. Get it in a positive way. We always were trying to hurt someone, rob someone, shove poison down someone's throat, or up their up their veins. You know that's not a way to go. We, our minds are better than that. We don't have to scoop down to sub level dimensions and categories just to get currency. It's a better way out, black men and black women. And women, your ass is not your worth. Your tits, your figure is not your worth. Instagram is getting an ass. But as long as you got perverts, that's what it's going to be. So, hey, that's going to be hard to stop.
because you got millions and millions of non-melanated non-melanated men and melanated men with their tongues hanging out, looking at those Instagram uh, vixens and stuff like that, and YouTube, all those exercise videos. Then you have the, then you have the, uh, <laughs> I call it the women in NFL. Oh, you know, I don't be honest, fellas, fellas. I done watched it. I done watched that woman in NFL here on YouTube. I tell you, boy, I'm going to be honest. I couldn't be no referee. Nope. Couldn't, I, I, nah. I couldn't be I couldn't be no coach. I couldn't do it. A man has to know his limitations, if you feel what I'm saying. So, I cannot tempt myself like that. But, Hey, man, all I can say to y'all is this. Y'all don't get caught up in this negative stuff. I keep telling y'all it's not worth it. Everyone on, what's that What's that young guy? Mr. Skittles, Nakashi, Takashi, 6 9 and all this. Everyone, everyone thinking they hurting his feelings. All y'all doing is making a man now. He is, he's back on top. I hope y'all know that. YouTube, y'all just up the ante. Whether y'all talk about him negatively or not. Y'all still got his name in the title, and y'all got his name. That's right. But y'all youngins, man. Y'all better, y'all, one thing y'all better know, get that bag. It's more ways to skin a cat. You getting that money, you got real estate out here. You got businesses you can invest in. You got land you can invest in. Because y'all have the means to do that. And you can invest in it and reap the benefits. And reap and be a beneficiary. You know, you can reap the benefits from the stuff you conquer and take over. Land, commerce, import. Export, trade, cargo. What y'all thinking about? People always need houses. People always need places of leisure. Meaning, y'all wanna, y'all wanna, y'all wanna spin y'all racks. Y'all wanna make it rain. Well, make it rain in a different way. If y'all gonna do that, which I don't endorse. Well, look, I don't endorse it. I don't agree with it. But be smart about it, though. If you're gonna make it rain. In the strip club, why won't you get a chain of strip clubs? You see what I'm saying? Why don't you own the goddamn thing? Not only that, if you can't get a liquor license in there, well, won't you pay and find out the ins and outs of how to get a business licenses and get a goddamn liquor store? If you're going to do it, consolidate everything that's out there that people been doing to us for years, who do we go to get our new ports from? Our new ports, our, our roll-ups, and our liquor, our alcohol. We go to the liquor store. We go to the gas station. Who do we go when mom and pops or whoever you under, y'all don't have a really good family unit. Who do we go to? Mama son and papa son and mama sauce. We get our, we get our combination rice. We get our mama sauce with chicken. We get our egg food young. Huh? We get our buffalo wings. Huh? We got french fries, huh? You know I'm telling the truth. We got steak and cheese, huh? With everything on it and hot sauce and hot peppers, huh? That's who we go to. They send that kid, they send they send their kids to college with our money. They send our, they they send their kids to college. They they make money off of our our laziness, man. Why we don't? Why the majority of our kids don't go to college? They end up in someone's cemetery, or trapping, or and then ending up in someone's jail, and then the next option. Some of them wake up, you know, they get scholarship. They still do good in school. It's the old saying: drug dealer, some you know, drug dealer, a a a, a jail a, a, a jailmate. You know, a jailhouse Negro, a football player, NFL, NBA, rapper, blah, 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 blah. 
and an entertainer or a comedian. So, I mean, that's the that's the norm. But we gotta look, man. We gotta we gotta snap out of that. We can be doing more than that. We engineers, real estate brokers, GMs, general managers, CEOs, production managers. I'm talking about heavy industry. Heavy industry. That's what we need to be focused on. Everyone can't shoot the everyone can't shoot the rock. Everyone everyone can't run the rock. Everyone can't get on the mic. You know what I'm saying? Everyone can't do that. We need different people in different categories of industries that's making big capital. That means big money. You know what I'm saying? And that's what the focus should be on. Don't let social media get you fooled. Remember, this is a non-melanated network. I keep telling you that. They're making, they making billions off of us. You hear me? And half of us, the majority of the Negro sector is a it's a cone show. It's an entertainment show. They sit back and laugh. Because they know people are people are pressed for proper, you know. A lot of a large amount of black folks are pressed for popularity, man. It's like a popularity contest. What's wrong with y'all? Know what it is though? It's a mental illness. You wasn't nothing in real life, so you get on here. Boom. What about you? If I come across one of y'all, guess what? Y'all get it. Many that I'm the same Negro. On this camera and off this camera. Let me tell you that. I'm the same Negro. I'm the same lit, lit, lit. I'm lit. Just like this is lit. I'm the same Negro on the camera and off the camera. On the camera, I'm the same Negro. <laughs> That's it. There ain't no faking in me, baby. I keep it. I keep it one hundred. And all these suckers on here that want to keep up with these beefs, y'all do y'all. Y'all do you. I'm gonna do me. So I, I I tell you, I'm a real G. I'm not a young G. I'm not a millennial. I'm original G. Real G's move in silence. We don't put everything up on someone else's platform to implicate ourselves. Whether it's positive, whether it's positive or negative, okay. That's that's see that's what y'all gotta figure out. It's all about business, y'all. Until y'all get that, y'all gonna be running around in these circles. And I hate to say, a lot of men have, a lot of black men have passed away and never figured it out, and that's a damn shame. A lot of black men gone from generation to generation because they never they end up like this, like this very cup I got. You know, I like my skulls, baby. They end up gone. They end up gone. And wasted their time on earth because they never figured it out. And that's why I'm here for because I want you to figure it out before it's too late. Mathematics. Construction trades, law, the learning of American system, the learning of your culture, your culture as being melanated men and women, the learning of your culture, your true identity. That's what y'all need to be studying, American culture and your true identity as Afro-Americans, which is Afrikaners, which is a Cubalon Negroes, or however you want to pronounce and and put it in a definition of rules and categories. You need to study American history, and you need to stretch. Let me say it again. You need to study Amer master American history and master your true identity and your history and your plight as being a black person right now in 2018 in America. And then you will carve out your pathway. But do not, by any means necessary, let me, hear me out. Do not. Do not cut the most high out because that's the only one that's going to open your mind up spiritually open your mind up to other possibilities not man by praying by meditating by fasting by being steadfast by walking 
the straight and narrow. You know what I'm saying? But if you don't take this in, if you don't comprehend this, you're not going to get this. You must check in. You must check in. You must check in. Or you're going to check out. You must check in. You must pay homage. You must be obedient. You must follow the statutes and rules and commandments to the best way of your possibilities and the best way of your abilities, or you're going to be done. See, this is not just only in the flesh. It's different levels to this. It's not only in the flesh. You understand? It's not only in the flesh. It's the spiritual, it's spiritual realms to this. You can play around if you want. You think it's a game? It's not a game, family. It's real life. We got a lot of work to do. It's not over. It's not over until the Most High says it's over. It's not over until the Most High. That's right. He is the judge and jury. He's the beginning, also the ending. So with that, it's time for us to work, work the good work. I don't just, I just don't put these videos out just to be playing around. It's always a method to the madness. Okay, y'all may see different things on my channel, but it's all it's gonna. Y'all will, you know. Y'all keep subscribing to people that have been... Y'all know what I'm about. Y'all know what I'm trying to get to. If y'all students of the game, y'all know what I'm doing. I'm telling you now. You got you to gotta leave that demonic life alone. Social media is in different compartments. You can be a troll... You heading down the fiery road, instigator. You head down the road of destruction, trolls road of destruction. These dudes, the, the these dudes are jealous and in a closet, sexually suspect negroes. Y'all going down to the road of destruction. Y'all women and men keep going back and forth fighting these gender wars. Y'all going down the road to destruction. It's not going to lead to no good outcome. It's going to lead to a sad outcome. And to you youngins and to these to these rappers or the ones that's aspiring rappers or the ones that, that's already made it, y'all got, got to come, y'all got to be independent. Because you're working for the ones that's been setting us up for years and been and been using our talent for cash cows. Y'all still rolling with them, that's all they're going to do. And once they feel like, once they feel like you useless, they're going to throw you to the wolves. I know the game, fam. Come mess with me. Subscribe, rate, thumbs it up, do what you do, share it, all of my productions. My time is done here. Until next time, I'm out.